Okay, so I have my Padlet and now I'm ready for my students to respond. They already have the link on their computers. So they are going to click on the plus sign and title. You may require them to put their name. Remember, I'm signed in still, so obviously my name's already on here, but theirs will be different. So require them to put their name and then you want them to go ahead and answer your question. And again, I would make sure I would talk about this. You know, this will be a good size paragraph. Um, make sure they're backing it up with two pieces of evidence and maybe give them a time limit because you don't want people finishing in a minute. So maybe like it should take at least, you know, five minutes, seven's the maximum you're talking with your partner. Um, but there's also some options here that you can explore with if you wanted them to do something besides type. Oh, and I would do this this after you get more comfortable with Padlet. Um, I haven't used all these tools, but you can record yourself talking. So you actually could have maybe the team the team members talk about the theme and the evidence, and then just voice record. Um, you know, so that's up to you how fancy you want to get later. They could put a link to maybe something they have typed. Okay, so just know there are other options. Um, I, again, I would start with the written response just because it's kind of easy, quick, um, and gets it out. You know, you can get your, their ideas out there, and then you can explore from there. Okay, so again, you would type the answer, and then you kind of click enter when you're done, and um, you can go to edit it. So the students will be able to edit their posts because you may look up at the board and say, oh, you didn't finish, you accidentally sent it. Um, and notice this is the one where I kept the hearts. I would establish a time where they have a few minutes to read all the responses and to choose the ones. And I would give them a guideline: choose the two, choose the two responses that have the most solid evidence, and they have backed up their claim. And you may heart those. So you and your partner are working together to find those two. Okay. And let me show you a finished one. So keep one that a class did and notice they were anonymous here but their names are right here as a teacher you can always click the trash can if you get anything that you don't want up on your board um, but they're in groups so you're going to know who's posting what so you're going to kind of look at these and this you know class clicked on the hearts obviously and they were writing um introduction so this is a great activity um miss o'shields did with her class and they typed the introduction and then they got to choose the best one. So you, you can have that conversation, you know, why did this, this group right here got four likes? Um, and so let's go ahead and read their introduction and decide, you know, what did they do differently? Why do we think they got, you know, four hearts? So it just makes for really good conversation. Thanks.